Hey, it's Calissa from Hits, and I am here today with Mira. Hi, guys. Hello, Hello everyone. We are Mira. Mira. Hi, I'm Katie. Hi, I'm Joe. Hi, I'm Eden. Hi, I'm Anselo. So you might be new to a lot of our listeners because you usually perform in like Chinese, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. But you recently dropped a English. debut yeah, English, English single yeah. called Rumors. Yeah. So what was the motivation um, be behind um, dropping an English single? Um, I think the reason of uh, we are why we released the English single is because um, we hope that we can have some music that allowed. Uh, the audience from different regions can listen to it and maybe it is a chance for them to know more about us and maybe it's a chance for them to know about Mira. So yeah, so we are just hope that uh, we hope that we can uh, publish some songs in English so everyone can listen to it. Yeah, yeah we're planning to do maybe uh, quite a lot of variety of different languages of songs but uh, maybe English is our first step but Maybe, just maybe, in other languages as well, maybe we will do, do it some other day. And um, releasing rumors is our first step, yeah. So this is not the last English single from yeah, you guys, for sure. Not. <laughs> not the last yeah. One, yeah. Was, it, was it a lot different um, recording an English song compared to recording a Chinese song? Yeah, definitely, because uh, the pronunciation is different, uh, the tone, the flow, and also we had to uh, learn about the uh, US pop culture, the rap flow, and also how to sing in uh, melodic rap and the verse. And I think it's quite different from uh, Cantonese pop as well. And the and the 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 major thing is the pronunciation because uh, we had to uh, sing in like a uh, native speaker and also uh, uh, to match with the U.S. culture and the market. So I think yeah, we had the coach uh, Andrew to teach us and also our producer uh, Edward as well. Uh, they taught us a lot of things throughout the whole process and. I think we learned a lot, yeah. Yeah. Okay, and you've also shared the stage with um, Alan Walker. So is there anyone else, now that you're doing more English music, is there anyone else that you would like to share the stage with? Wow, wow. If in terms of English music. Coldplay. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I love Coldplay a lot. Yeah. I love Coldplay. They are singing very well. <laughs> yeah. For sure. Yeah. <laughs> For sure. <laughs> For sure. Uh, Actually, uh, cooperating with Aaron Walker is already really unbelievable for us. Yeah, because he's a really big star and yeah, uh, globally, internationally. So we have many idols actually. For example, <laughs> he loves Blackpink a lot. <laughs> uh, and, uh, we love Big Bang, BTS. <laughs> yeah, so I think different artists from different places, all of them are really a really um, great, great opportunity for, for us. us. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, well, I have um, solo questions for you guys. Okay. So, Kyungto, um, your Instagram bio says that you you got a dream, you got to protect it. So, what is one dream that you hope to achieve by the end of 2023? Um, it's definitely is my concert because it's uh, this year I have my it's the first time I have my own concert. So, I'm really I'm very exciting about it. Yeah, so, I think uh, we everyone have my the own concert. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Your so, own solo. Yeah, solo the concert. solo concert is not the group concert. Wow, is it already planned? Do you already have dates? Yeah, we already. Yeah, it's already planned, but the date is not released yet. It's yeah, not really sure. Yeah, it's, it's the coming months. Yeah. Cool. Sounds like it's gonna be an exciting year. Yeah. <laughs> and um, Anson. Uh, before Mira, you were a backup dancer and you performed for big names like Aaron Kwok, Kelly Chen and Coco Lee. Um, so if you had to give up everything and go back to just dancing, who would you like to join on tour? Who would I join as a... As if you had to give up everything and go back to being a backup dancer. Oh, Blackpink! Black <laughs> <laughs> easy! Didn't even have yeah, to Yeah, easy <laughs> question because... Uh, but I, I, I don't think I'm qualified because uh, to be a part of the dance team of Blackpink because they are all very professional and also very well trained, very skilled. So I don't think I I will be up to their standard, but uh, if I can, if I could, then yeah, it's my pleasure. Yeah. Okay. 
All right, and um, Eden, mm. you're known as the group's quadruple talent. <laughs> Uh, you sing, you act, and you got two mm. Hong Kong Film Award nominations recently. So, what is your favorite thing about both singing and acting? Um, of course, it's my pleasure to have those different opportunities for me to perform, no matter as acting or singing or anything. And I really enjoyed uh, all these different kinds of performing. Yeah. So, uh, for me, I just hope that I can keep. Uh, improving in different areas, no matter at, no matter acting, singing or dancing, so I can be a uh, like you said, a quadra <laughs> talented, <Quadruple> talent. <laughs> talented artist. Yeah, it's my dream. Yeah. Okay, and finally, um, Jer, Jer, yes. Jer, um, you were once an entertainment reporter, which is kind of like yes. what I'm doing right now. <laughs> yes. So, what is one question that you think I should ask you guys to wrap up this interview? Ooh. Wow. What would you like to say for Malaysian audience? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> He's a pro. Wow. <laughs> That's a very good question. Oh my god. So yeah. professional. I think it's very it's it's very pleasing to see uh, each and every one of you in KL to uh, to just have fun last night for us because uh, it's our very first time and also it's um, uh, many of you for many of you it's your first time as well to see us in person so I think uh, it's a very special night and. Uh, uh, you guys went crazy and we we were very overwhelmed by your energy so I think um, maybe next year uh, hopefully we will do a world tour and we'll see you guys next year soon yeah okay now that we got all the serious stuff out of the way okay <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to play a game with you guys okay so since you're called mirror yeah um, I brought four different mirrors Wow. And you might have um, seen this gameplay before, so I'm gonna say a statement. And usually you'll just say like someone's name. Like if I say who's the foodie of the group, maybe mm. you'll say, oh, everyone okay. says Jerry. But this time I want you to show the mirror to the person okay. of uh, who matches that statement. Okay. So this game is called Look in the Mirror. You guys ready? Yes. Yes. Who is the night owl? <laughs> Joe was so fast with that. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, who is the messiest? I don't want to do it, but I think... It's you, again! <laughs> <laughs> Who's most addicted to social media? Anderson. Oh! <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I'll take it. I'll, I'll take it, I'll take it. Um, who is the foodie? Foodie! You can tell! You can tell! <laughs> yeah, I don't know why Two I of us! You can tell Two by that. The... <laughs> okay, foodie. and who's the loudest? Loudest? Me. Yeah. Ha ha ha! <laughs> you can see I'm the loudest. Okay, and the last one. Everybody loves. Who's the one that everybody loves the most? Every time you walk into a room. Wow. wow. Everyone! Yeah. 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 to ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well thank you so much Mira for joining me today. I hope you get to discover more about Malaysia while you're here. Yeah. And I hope that you'll be joining us real soon and we get to play more of your songs on hits. Thank you so much. Thank you. So much. Thank you. Bye bye. bye.